This is Trey Cox, and you're watching Tiger TV. So what experience are you looking forward to the most? Honestly, um, just knowing that students have a good time the whole week, um, it's a hard and long and stressful process, but at the end of the day, just knowing that our work is definitely noticed by students and students have a good time, that's all we can ask for. That's the big idea? Yeah. So what has been your biggest task so far? Solidifying homecoming artists, definitely. As far as like hip hop, we had a, we put out a survey this summer um, for like who we would have as like our sure. headliner, and so based on the response that we got, we decided to go with Future. We won by like a landslide, literally. Yeah. And so from there, it was like trying to get enough of following acts to like compensate for what sure. we had already spent on our main act. So that was the toughest part on like solidifying artists, definitely. Cool. Um, for the fashion show, it's definitely uh, solidifying a great, solid, strong team that will be able to delegate each task. So creatively selecting great uh, creative directors. Um, so creative directors, we have uh, Brendan Fountain and Cheryl Smith. Uh, they're both very great, very talented. Also, Dominic Jackson as a, a stylist, as the main stylist, has been really on his job as, for, as far as booking different yeah. um, stylists and getting different people, different designers to put their photos to the show. So, it's, so like you said, there's a lot going on packed all into this one week. So where can we find you at during all of this? What you gonna be up to? Um, <laughs> I'll either, either be in student life, honestly, okay. or I mean, in class when I can. Okay, or, so still working, yeah, still, still working. working <laughs> or I mean, really just doing events. I mean, literally from 8 a.m. Mm -hmm. to the end of the night, there's something to do for an event. So sure. if I'm not on campus running around, hopefully I'll be find time for class. Education first. But yeah, got you. And a lot of people are looking forward to this homecoming. So what can we expect to be different from last year's homecoming? That might be even better. So one of the big things that we did, we cut the uh, schedule down. Okay. So based on feedback, we felt the need to cut some of the events out. And so we try to give you better events, more quality events in a shorter period of time. So versus starting on Sunday, it's now on Monday. And so it goes Monday to Saturday, literally with solid shows, jam-packed, everything, great production, great artists. We really wanted to condense that to give you guys a better just production. And hopefully it'll only get better and we'll get more money to get more stuff and then yeah, definitely. Keep on innovating. I love it. Of course. I could also uh, like to add that we're actually having our own fashion show again this year. I know it hasn't happened for two years now. It didn't happen last year. So we have that back. And so we're actually partnering up with the hip-hop show again. So it's um, that's something that's pretty much tradition we do every single year. So last year we didn't have that, but now we do have the element back into the, the, uh, the homecoming experience. So cool, yeah, cool, cool. definitely. And we're looking to get feedback. We're going to be putting a yes. survey on our website so where people can let us know how they're enjoying the homecoming experience okay. and let us know what type of programs they would like to see in the following years and during the school year. All right, go ahead and tell us what the website is. It's morehousecasa.com. So it's morehouse, Casa. as normally spelled, C-A-S-A dot com. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha. All right, well, we appreciate you guys for sharing with us. Thank you. Of and course. we can't wait yeah. to see what has to come. Gifford standing I'm Artemius Moore. And I'm Jonathan Tebow. And you're watching Tiger TV.